and they could sit with their friends and say, what would you do? I, would have, I don't know if I'd have bluffed that pot. And it really got everybody involved. And I think historically, as far as the popularity of the game, it just made the game explode. The sentimental coda to this new age of poker is that the age of the great Texas rounders seems to be riding into the sunset. Case in point, in 2002, Amarillo Slim lost a heads-up battle in the World Series to 27-year-old wonderkin Phil Ivey, the first time Slim had ever lost such a match. The downside for them is that it's a hell of a lot harder to win a poker tournament with 800 people in it than it is to win one with 12 or 15 people in it. And their dominance faded out rather quickly now that everyone could get in on the act. The clock is running out on Doyle Brunson's private game, but the stakes remain high. Chip and Phil challenge each other 